I'm giving away an all expenses paid trip to the Wit Sundays with me on board Mahoki Uncharted in August. All you got to do is make sure you're following Mahoki Uncharted and Offshore Adventures on Instagram, subscribe to Offshore Adventures on YouTube, and tag the mate you're taking with you. Each new tag of a different mate is another entry. We're also giving $1,000 cash to cover your flight because we don't want to organize it. And the winner is drawn on the 4th of July. So tag your mates, get tagging. It's very soon. The trip is in August, and I'm keen to take a couple of you guys up to the reef and have a awesome time surfing, diving, fishing, whatever you want to do. Get tagging. I hope to see you soon. You catch the latest trend. I might double up my network. I've been going up now. See the top going down. If you didn't know now, know you know now. Best cut seeker going top. You're not really top. You keep saying top. Well, I guess you let the top down. I've been going up now. See the top going down. If you didn't know now, know you know now. Best cut seeker going top. You're not really top. You keep saying top. Well, I guess you let the top down. Good morning. It's day six. We are at Manly Yacht Club. I missed the whole day because yesterday we were just driving back to Brizzy. We went out last night, so it wasn't really worth filming anything for offshore adventures. But yeah, day six, we're heading back to Morton for the day. We'll leave soonish and uh, get our trip started again. But yeah, it was just a bit of a stopover, get some resources, food, and extra beer because we're getting through them quicker than what we thought. Look at that. Another day ending here. That's the sunny coast. So the plan today completely changed. We're actually going up to Lady Musgrove, maybe even Fraser, I don't know, but we're going, just trekking it for 15 hours today. So we didn't really do anything today apart from put the rods out for a couple of hours. But yeah, look at this. Good morning, after trekking it all night, we finally made it to Fraser Island. We came through the bar, which is over there, where most people get their four drives over to the island at about 5.30 in the morning. I'll see under sleep. And yeah, this is the southwest side of the island that I've never really seen before, which is pretty cool. And there's a little river there. I'm gonna fly my drone in a minute just to put it up and see what it looks like from the sky. But yeah, first time at Fraser Island, pretty stoked. Really nice day for it too, so no complaints. Just brought the tender out from Mahoki. Got Michael. Hey, yo, mate. Welcome hey. to the channel. Well, you probably realise that that's a different tender. That's because this happened. Yep. No comment. Anyway, back to the video. That's Paul's nephew. We're just fishing around Fraser Island, around the southwest side, and we'll just cast around these rocks and snags and see if we can get something. Michael's on. What are you calling? Ah, oh, a little boom or something, surely. Little oh, nice. First fish of the day. Beauty. First fish for me, a little... Is that a golden trevally? Yeah, it looks like a little trevor. My first proper fish on the trip, I think it's a little golden trevally or something like that. It's tiny, but it's better than a yakka. We're just pulling up, about to stop. And I thought I'd just leave the lure in until we fully stop. Solid, eh? Top boy to stop it. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> hey, hit like a going hard for a going like, hard for a few You don't you don't get what Trev and Queen get. Yeah, but it hasn't jumped yet, so I don't know if it's a cleaning. Hey boys. Tuna. Big Mac tuna. That is our shark bait tonight. Good shit, Harry. That's the first oh, fish of the trip. Yeah, that's the first, first decent. Yeah, first decent fish of the 
That's a big back yeah, turn. Nice. On the house. Hold him up, Harry. Right? How good? Hey, boys. Phew. Solid one. Boys, Audi, we just uh, moved from that corner of Fraser to Kingfisher Bay, kind of where all the ferries come. And yeah, we anchored up there, just brought the tinny over, and we're just dropping jigs and throwing stick baits and stuff like that. Seconds oh, on. Handshakes. On the live squid. Snapper. Oh. Nah, so Emperor. Back with the first good fish. Grassy Emperor. Yep. Cod. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> Is that a pinky? <laughs> One little snapper. Yep, that's better. Yeah, boys, grab the net, get the net. <laughs> that's what you want to hear. That's a tuna. I'm not. Oh, hey! Is it tuna? <laughs> yeah, boys. Absolutely. That's what you wanted. Oi! Oh, hey. On the little 3000. He's going skids. Oh, oh, he pulled hooks. What did he snap me? Oh, he pulled hooks. Spewing. That was sick. Saxon's on the shark rod. Twin power screaming. Oh, Get down there. What are you calling, Saxon? Oh, shark. What type of shark? Paul says we've got to get in. Boy. Mate, if you could just. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get some colour. You're getting him, he's coming up. Oh, there he is. Oh, it's a big ride. Locking this up. Yeah. Come here, you little Ended up snapping it off because I think it reefed us, but um. If you need help doing your FGs, get Saxon. <laughs> That's our first and last day for Fraser. We're steaming to Lady Musgrave overnight tonight. We're all just going to have a few stints at driving. And yeah, made a couple of fish. Probably our most successful day on the rods so far, which wasn't too good. But when I lost that Queenie, it would have been my first Queen fish. But you know, it was still pretty fun on the Sustain 3000. But yeah, we're still at the lures out now, so you never know. We could have hooked something else up before it gets dark. But yeah, next stop, Lady Musgrave. You. That's a bit of fish from all the dives we've done. It's a mix of fish, tusky, and heaps of others. So I'm gonna cook all that up for dinner. We got other stuff as well, but I didn't really want to waste it. So I'll, I don't know what I'll do. I'll put some flour in there and mix it all up and some spices and stuff like that. It should be pretty good, I reckon. Cooking up the fish. Obviously, this is my first catch and cook on a boat. A bit of proper oven, proper stove set it is, but usually I just use my portable gas cooker. But she's going alright. What happens when you let me in the kitchen? <laughs> but we, we do have all the That's fish cooked. Good. A couple bit burnt, but no, it's a bit hard. There was that much fish and I was using two fry pans, but it's all good. Good morning and welcome back. We finally reached our number one destination which everyone wanted to come to. It's Southern Great Barrier Reef. So we've got Bareback Island over there. We've got Lady Musgrave in the distance. We are frothing. How's the sunrise? A bit of wind today but that's not going to stop us. That was screaming. Yeah. I just thought I'd put the rods out and got something. I don't know what it is but... Hopefully something I've never caught before. Hey! Wow. Tuna! Got the tuna. We don't need him, we'll just get him back. We took the tender off the drop off. Lady Musgrave. We're really just using jigs, vibes, stuff like that, but hopefully we can get a few fish. Yep. 
Yep, yep. First fish. Get the net, get the net. Just so it's ready. Yeah, boys. Yeah, boys. Just after I got a tangle up. <laughs> so I got the Stratic 6000 saltwater edition. It's got 40 or 50 pound. Here it comes with the car. What do you got? My first golden trevally. Is that a golden? Uh, gold spot. Is that a gold spot? Oh, Mike was on. Yeah. Bait fisherman turned lure fisherman. <laughs> Come on. That had a massive big run. Just pump them white. Yeah, bruh. Get him up. I didn't like a trap, but now it's not. No way! <laughs> Get the cat, surely you didn't get a cobia. Oh, he's got a cobia. That's a good one too. You? Oh, Are you kidding? Oh, baby. That's a good cobia too. Wow. Oh. That is a good fish man. Come here baby. You? On the van fit. Are you joking? Five minutes in and a cobia. That is a good fish. Are you yeah, kidding? Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's awesome. That pressure, Brody. <laughs> yeah. yeah, boys! Yeah. Yeah. Look at that! Oh. Are you kidding? Yeah, mate, best fish of the yeah. trip so far. Oh, oh hey. hey! Yeah, boys! Hold him out again, hold him out for a photo fish. Five minutes in, three fish already. You right? Oh, yeah. Louie. Tusky. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> this is a mixed bag. This Venus. Is Venus tusk fish. That's three different species in five minutes. Wow, this Love is just off cap. Oh, first red throat of the trip. Smallest red throat. Yeah. Another red throat. That's a bit bigger. Saxon with a pretty good red throat emperor. He'll be coming back with his feet. Boys are filleting. There's a remora. Oh, it's a shark. This guy knows nothing about fish. Huh? <laughs> Is it a shark? <laughs> nah. That is insane. So I'm going to send my drone up. I'm going to send it up as high as I can and as far away as I can and hopefully show you guys what this place looks like from a bird's eye view because it's absolutely insane. Today was our first day on the reef and I managed a nice crawled trout and a nice spangled emperor. They're not my first species, but I mean, can't complain, crawled trout are one of the best eating fish in the ocean. Spangled emperor aren't too bad either. And how's this absolutely beautiful afternoon? Mid fillet job and the boys hooked up to a shark. Yeah. 
the ghosts are screaming. Good morning, the last full day on the reef. Taking the tender out, got the rods. Fingers crossed, we'll get some fish. I don't know what it even is. I don't know if it's very good. Oh, wait, what's that? Trevally or something? Wait, someone grab the net. Just put a new jig on. I don't even know what we hooked. A little. What is that? Oh, Mac Tuna. Cheers, bro. First Mac Tuna on the jig. Me and Anthony from Quite Over the Bay actually made that jig in the store when I used to work there, but yeah. Drop it. Second fish, as soon as I hit the bottom, I might have just tangled. Oh no. We got what the hell is that? Tomato coral cod <laughs> on the jig. Seconds on. I think I'm gonna have the same tomato cod thing as the other. Oh double tomato coral cod things. Yours is a bit bigger. I don't know if he's gonna swim. His swim bladders come up. He might be alright. Oi, straight on! Two fish in two minutes. What do you got? Might finally get oh, <laughs> that's oh. decent as. Hell yeah. First trout, and it's a nice one. Look at that. One of the best eating fish literally in the ocean. Coral trout. Michael on the bait. Oh, what it's got. Something good, trout, 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 trout. Yeah. <laughs> Second trout of the day. It's a good spot here. Yep, yep, bit better. Give us trout. Oh, maybe cod. It's not fighting much. Trout, trout. Yeah. Right. Coronation trout. Right, yes, mind. boys. Right. That's a coral cod. Coral cod. Prettiest fish I've ever seen. Supposedly tastes delicious. It's hard keeping a fish that pretty, but we're gonna eat it. Jackson's on again. Good colour. Oh, Coro. Oh, oh. Are you kidding? Oh, oh yes! Yeah. <laughs> That's a stonker. Jackson's first coronation trout. Look at the colours in that. Amazing. Oh, that was at the top. Look at that. Right here, look. It's the same already. What is it? I think it's a tuna. No! It's mackerel. Oh my god. Could be alright. Oh. Do you reckon I got shark? <laughs> no. Few of the reef's finest and prettiest fish. Got coral trout. Coral trout. Coronation trout and coral cod. And look at the colours on the fish. It's absolutely insane. Only got a few hours left on the reef, so I'm not going to waste it. Brandy and I are suiting up and we will just go up the lagoon. And there's a few bombies all through here. It's pretty fished out, but there are some fish, some spangled everywhere, and some coral trout here and there, so it's worth a try. It looks clear, so we can get in the water. What are we running today? Got the Alco laser probe, two meters high. 
Max and a bigger mat. So this thing has caught the two only fish that we've got on the trail so far. So I'll put it back on my rod. But yeah, we'll try run three, three out there and see what happens. Let's see how we go. First fish on sunset. What do we call them, Vogler? Uh, tuna, I reckon. Could be like a marlin. It's jumping out the back. Oh shit! It is. It, it is a marlin. Bullshit. <laughs> Whose idea was it to put the rods back out? <laughs> Yours actually. Black. 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 No, it's a striped marlin. I think that's a black marlin. Loves it. Not happy about it, is he? <laughs> Good morning, it is day nine, I think. We're at Fraser Island, Mahoki's over there. How insane is this? This is Watumba Creek on Fraser's west coast. And the water is just absolutely insane. Like none of the boys can really like fathom how crazy clear this water is. It doesn't even look like Australia. There's turtles cruising in and out of the creek. Fresh water getting pushed down, down there. And yeah, this is just insane. And that's probably a wrap for day eight or nine, whatever day it is, but we just went to Fraser Island and we trolled all the way here, didn't actually hook anything, which we were surprised about, but yeah, we're heading to Double Island Point now, which is mainland Australia. We've had cracker sunsets this trip. Like it literally just doesn't get much better than that. Job right. Yeah, the boys. How are we feeling? I'm feeling fantastic, Hazard. Got a couple of beers up me, we're blasting the tunes up top. It's a glorious day. What else would you want? That's it. He said it better than me, but yeah. Anyway, peace out. We'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, it's day nine, and we're crossing the Fraser Island bar right now. It's a pretty big bar, but there are some waves breaking. There won't be any problem for this big girl. Go through the bar, now we're at Double Island Point. This place is sick. I'll just put the drone up there is a huge bust up about a kilometer just down the beach pretty sure they're big long tail tuna it looked absolutely epic on the drone as you guys just saw so we're gonna race there with the 30 horses we got and <laughs> get there in about five minutes and chuck medals and stick baits and stuff at them and hopefully we hook up we got our smaller reels but we're keen for a dusting so we want to get smoked and they look like big fish so Let's get there and go. Yeah, neutral, 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 neutral. Watch our right. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, look at that! Get in there. That was hectic. <laughs> Yes! yes! Got one on. <laughs> yeah, boys. <laughs> yes, boys. Brody was just using a little metal with a little one single hook. Managed to hook up. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> Spilling. <laughs> Oh, it's a Mac tuna. Big Mac tuna, but. 
<laughs> He's a big dog. Big Mac trainer. Brody with a big Mac trainer. Well, it's a fish. We'll chuck him back, but. <laughs> Spewing up all the bait. So they're eating these little micro peel chips. Off he goes. We ended up not catching any long tail tuna. Brody managed one big Mac tuna. But I had a look on the drone, they're 100% long tail. Well, most of them anyway. We probably managed to get the one Mac tuna in the school. Just unloading all the gear. It's a fair bit of gear. That's not even half of it. Right, uh, today is the end of an awesome boys trip. Thanks to all the boys for making it. Let's go. A trip to remember. That was yeah, that was awesome. Thanks, Jose and Jose B, wherever he's gone, for cleaning up after us. Um, thanks, Cook Paul, for cooking us some good food and last but not least paul thank you so much mate pleasure mate this was an unbelievable trip i think all the boys will have memories that will last us a lifetime and if you like this episode make sure you follow mahoki uncharted you guys could be doing the exact same thing we did even better than what we did thanks to paul so yeah thanks again paul pleasure mate. it's a trip Come to remember you who's going <laughs> <laughs> The boys are racing to where? Where are we going? Malulaba. Yeah, Somewhere. Yeah. Somewhere. <laughs> where are we go? Where are we actually go? Malulaba. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're all good. We're all good. We've got to do this to him. He hasn't been pissed all trip. The Saxon. Second last day. He's done himself a mischief. 